Nick Arcade challenged me and said, I'll pay Paul you $50 if you can beat Boss Rash with Rose. Full curse from at least Skull and Trona Box with Wicked Season and only one weapon. Oh, okay. Well, uh, here's my PayPal address, and I would say we easily do that. Let's just ignore the final part of the message, okay? There we go. Uh, did I? Yeah, okay. It shifted over. So only one singular weapon. Now, how can we do this? Antitome is already insane, right? Yeah, we definitely want to have this early on. And there's even... Oh, School of Maniac. I'll take that as well, just that it's locked in. Didn't need to take it there. Now, can Lapador will be insanely helpful? Okay. Uh, Empty Tome sounds good. Honestly, I don't even see where the problem should be, right? If you think about it. Armor is ridiculous because you take way less damage. And since we heal... Okay, here are the damage numbers, by the way. I kind of forgot about them. But yeah, we heal 8 HP. So double healing is insane. There's Toruna, very good. Oh, I just realized we kind of want to have a lot of might, though. What is, like, the final weapon that I want to have? I don't really care about Duplicator. It doesn't change all too much. Mm, do I spawn in additional bosses? It doesn't really help me how I think about it. I mean, we can do it. I think I just want to go for Tirachisu, maybe. Ye sure. People would probably expect that I go for Mad Groove and pull in all the stage items, but I don't really want to do that. You know, it, it's just way too overpowered, so let's not do that. Let's see if we can do it this way. Uh, there's more Empty Tome. We could also get Clover, though. The benefit of Clover would be that we crit more, which causes more of these, these blade effects. Nah, 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 we'll do it this way. Can Lapador, very nice. Honestly, I don't really understand the challenge, like... <laughs> <laughs> oh, spinach. Do I even need the revivals is the thing. If I just get spinach, I have so much damage and damage multipliers in the game. I think that is way more insane. Let's just do it. You know, you don't need to revive if you just never die. It's that simple. But yeah, challenging someone with 1400 hours in this game to such a simple challenge. Am I just missing something? Is, is there like a major trick? Like, there is a reason why I call this weapon one of the most broken weapons. And sure, right now, the weapon is bugged, okay? So it loses the title of one of the most broken weapons in the game in general because this little ball around me is so tiny. Usually it grows to a ginormous size if you have Google Law of Illusions. But I'm not concerned. This weapon still deals a ginormous amount of damage and I think I'll just easily deal with that. Uh, luck doubling, yep, that's great. Single chest, I mean, we already know how that is, right? Dex doesn't get the triple chests. <laughs> uh, spinach, uh, let's go for Skullomaniac. I feel fairly confident that we can easily deal with the enemies. Now, the difficulty is a little bit the bosses, you know? Since we have such a tiny bubble around us, we can't really easily deal with them. But we have crit explosions that sometimes happen. For some reason, they're also in different size. Have you noticed that? Like the balls, they don't always have the same size. But yeah, that's probably the best way to just deal with bosses. Uh, Skullomaniac, let's keep going for that. That no one says that I just wait. I just took the freeze. Oh, that's bad. Um, yeah, so for things like this, you really want to prepare items that you can use them in the moment you need them the most. Let's actually think about the, the crucial parts. What are like the failing points? And one thing, oh, there's a freeze, perfect. One thing I can think of is the Reapers that spawn, because it will be a little bit difficult to kill them in time. So we definitely want to go for Silent Old Sanctuary to attack more and also have... Thank you. I guess. I didn't even notice that. And I guess we also have to go for... Oh. How many Arcana do you get on this chest? Do you get the usual three, or do you only get one? How many rolls do I have? I have all ten. Yeah, I would have been surprised if I used them in a single weapon run. No, but... Uh, uh, I'm actually... Okay, <laughs> this is a bit of a problem. I'm actually not sure if you get two Arcana or one. Now, what is better if we only had one singular Arcana? Silent Old Sanctuary or Wicked Season? I mean, Silent Old Sanctuary gives us how much bonus damage? 100% bonus damage, that is insane. The character every 10 level ups on the 8 ending levels, I think, gets 10% bonus damage until it's back to normal. Like, it's not higher than normal, it's just back to normal. Mm, so the damage is actually quite insane. Yeah. And especially the cooldown, because right now we are on negative 45%. So to reverse that, we have 55% cooldown right now on the weapon. You know, if it's usually uh, one second, then it's zero. Uh-huh. Oh. Interesting. Um, interesting. Well, that could be a problem. I just lost my only revival that I had, and now they have more curse. Okay. Uh-huh. 
Mm, okay, I see the problem. Yeah, okay. So, when do I get my Arcana? When is that? Oh, I just skipped time. I guess. Yeah. Uh, I have to. I have to fire the butts. Okay, that's not really working. We have a freeze here. I have to kill this witch. Oh no! Oh no! Please die! Please die! Please die! The curse is about to happen. Why did I take the freeze before the curse happened? Oh, okay. Um. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I could have. Oh. Uh. Oh, we killed everything. Nice. Oh, that's good. Did I get a rosary? Wait, what happened there? I think I got a rosary. Uh, we have to skip forward to the Akena. Like, we have to get there ASAP. I should have went for Tirachisu. I was a little bit overconfident. I didn't realize how difficult this could be. So this is where we should get the Akena. The good thing is there are a huge amount of enemies spawning. I was talking about something before, but yeah, I totally forgot about that. Uh, because I died. <laughs> More area, nice. Is our ball growing? Wait, is our ball growing? Is it bug because of, because of Google of Illusions? Maybe? Is that the reason? Because I definitely see my ball growing. Dude, I know the size of my balls, so I see when it gets bigger. Speed is totally useless. I should uh, stop taking that. Yeah. Okay. Oh, we actually have Boogaloo of Illusions here. That could be a way to go, but we will definitely go for... Where is it? Where is it? <laughs> well, now we have a see. Do you see the attack speed, though? Isn't this amazing? Like, do you see how crazy it's going? Yeah, so he said only one weapon, but only one weapon he meant like starting weapon, right? We could technically get another weapon here. Mm, I mean, just reading the comment, it should be fine to get a candy box and an additional weapon, but uh, I don't think that's what he meant, right? He didn't write a lot, so I kind of have to make up the rest of the rules that are fitting to what he said there. Oh, wow, that, that was a pin needle. Wow, <laughs> that was insane. Mmm... I'm currently wondering. I mean, we can just push through, right? No, I shouldn't have pushed through. That means less level ups. Ooh, and we definitely want to have might level ups because our weapon crits. We actually benefit more from the level ups than the enemies grow in health. So it's good to level up as much as possible. Let's not skip time anymore. Uh, area is always nice. Yeah, our ball is growing like crazy. So is the issue actually Google of Illusions? Wow, yeah, it seems to... Maybe the Google of Illusions breaks something in the game. I mean, let's take a look at this. If our ball keeps growing, the more area we get on it. Which most people would say, duh, that's, duh, that's normal. But if you watched the last video, you know something is broken about the weapon. Or, well, I've shown some screenshots there. But I tried to limit break the weapon solo and something got messed up. Uh, our damage right now is 170%. If I remember it right, this should go up to 210% in total. Okay, so just a few more level ups and we got it. Yeah, let's take a look at this. So right now we are level 67 and on this level up here, it should go up by 10%. Uh, oh, it's not every 10 levels. Yeah, now it went up. What was that for level? So to 72, it went up by 10%. Interesting. Dude. <laughs> We have such insane nuker. I will actually remove the damage numbers because there's not really a benefit in seeing them. We have the luck doubling. Didn't get anything, sadly. Does duration even help me? I don't think so. Right? Because it only buffs up the main attack. Okay, so the issue is the main attack is needed to cause the, the balls that we have here. Because the balls get created when we crit. You know, so the stronger the main attack is or the more main attacks we have or the more enemies that get hit by the... Okay. Okay, in this approach, I got the crown on my very first level up, and I immediately went for it. I kind of forgot about how bad the growth is on this character, and even though we have scaling growth with Wicked Season, it's not a lot. Now, do I want to go for Tirachisu here? I feel like I'm missing something. I mean, armor would be really good. Yeah, because we heal so much. But if we lose Tirachisu in all of our revivals, we could just go for armor. No, I like the idea. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, ironically, there's an issue I didn't consider. <laughs> now that we get way more experience, um, I actually have to skip every single time and even that is not enough. I'm about to max out. And do you remember what the main problem was? The curse. So... Yeah, that just means I max curse in a moment. Look at this. <laughs> I try to delay it as much as possible. But because we get so much uh, uh, growth now, yeah, that's, that's actually a problem. Okay, single chest, of course. Oh no, why did you have to do that? I mean, it was a 50-50 what it offers me, right? So, oh, there's another chest, beautiful. You could have just given me a triple chest, you know, just just to get quicker to, just to get faster to the limit break. But yeah, uh, we are maxed out already. That is the insane difference of growth on a character that has low growth. 
So, how do I want to do this now? I actually believe I do not want to time skip anymore. Yeah, because we can just limit break like crazy now. Nine. Uh, yeah, listen, I. Ugh, whatever, it's fine. Nah. So, it's a little bit complicated because we kind of just want to. Okay, um, I will so die. I will so die. It's a little bit complicated because on one side, I definitely want to time skip to get to the Arcana faster, you know? But on the other side, we will die. <laughs> so. <laughs> uh huh. Uh -huh, there's a freeze. I will pick that up. That was a little bit too early, but the good thing is they will just be frozen, so they don't get to me. I need another freeze, though. Uh, there's a magnet. That could actually be nice, but I don't really want to use that. That's... I have to keep moving is another thing. If I don't keep moving, then my weapon is a lot weaker. Area, very good. Uh, speed, might, might is very good. Area, amount is beautiful, I think at least. I'm not too convinced if a mount is actually needed. But yeah, I don't want to time skip. I just want to have more time to grow myself. Well, but can I even grow enough to really deal with bosses? Or would it just be better to always time skip? I guess we can time skip to five minutes, you know, to immediately get the Arcana. Silent Old Sanctuary is just a major difference, you know, in, in damage output. I don't have a freeze around. Okay. Uh, and this is like one of the worst waves possible, probably. Okay. Yeah, this will be difficult. We had a level up, so we get some immunity. <sighs> now I see why this was a challenge, you know. <laughs> I will definitely time skip, but the problem is I still have to kill the, the bosses that appear there, you know. So I don't know if I can actually do that. That is amazing. Wow. Just keep growing, my friend. I think it maybe stops growing when you reach a high enough level where it stops giving you bonus might and something in the code is just messed up. And this is the crap that killed me, by the way, so I should be a little bit more careful. Um, the issue is the growing claws get so big that they hit you when you are above the crab. Why is he so tanky? Why is he so insanely tanky? I actually have to walk up here. Yeah, and he starts hitting me again. Jeez, Louise. You are quite something and the curse is about to happen. This is not good. Um, I think, yeah, I have to take the freeze. I think I would have died otherwise. Let's just kill him ASAP. Okay, nice, nice, beautiful. Wait, just imagine we actually had Boogaloo of Illusions here. How big this would be. Do you think Boogaloo of Illusions would have been the way to go? Just to hit the enemies earlier. Like, if you insta-kill the enemies, it doesn't matter if you attack 10 times a second or once a second, because they'll just die. I'm dying. Am I? The hardest part is just seeing the enemies, where the bosses are and things like that. I think I can easily deal with a majority of the enemies, but uh, the bosses are a problem because they hide in the normal enemies. And when I walk around, I walk right into the bosses. So I guess we just have to get a little bit lucky and use my brain a little bit more. A crit or mad groove? Crit or mad groove? Crit or mad groove? I mean, crit has insane scaling. But if I go for Mad Groove, I'll get armor, I'll get more healing, I have way more HP. If I go for Awake, I also get that same thing. Uh-oh. Uh-huh. Okay. Um, freeze. That was tight. <laughs> Wait, what just happened there? Uh, okay. Is there a freeze? No, I don't think so, right? Yeah, I don't think so. So... Wait. Um, okay, if we can't beat this now, then I honestly don't know what to do. Do I just have to stand? St I can't stand still. I can't just stand still. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah, I will definitely time skip here. There's a freeze. There's the ender? Where's the other arcana? Where's my other arcana? No, you can't just do that. Okay, there's a freeze. Let's get uh, over here. Let's get the NFT. Where? Where's the ender? Where is he? Where is he? No, he's over there. I have to walk through. I'm sorry. Oh, Akena. Okay, 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 slash. Nice. We could have tried other things, but let's try this for now. Dude, he's just wrecking me. How much damage are we dealing, though? That's the most... Dude, we have so many damage numbers in there. Wait, I can just stay here. Is this enough to kill him? No way, right? Yeah, it was no way. Okay. Uh, the issue is I have to stay low. I have to walk through here. I have to stay low that when the other Reapers spawn, they spawn at the bottom and not at the top, because otherwise I get drowned, like, quite literally. Uh, let's just try this. Okay, that's not working. Um, he's rushing after me! Oh, wow, that was close. We killed him! We killed him! 
That is the main boss. We just killed him. There's no one around. Uh, yeah, this is the power of crits, by the way, in case you were wondering. Uh, now the other Reapers spawn, but they are a joke in comparison. Like, the toughest part is dealing with all of them at once when the end... There is a round. Why did that just happen? That was not supposed to happen. Uh-huh. Okay, I'm noticing they are trying to cut me off and, uh, um, 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 mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I need a freeze. I need, what do I need here? More HP is really good. They just kind of wipe me. I could go for more damage though. No, I think I'll go for the armor. Yeah, let's hope that this works because I will just die here, I think. Oh my god, that was a really nice juke. Oh my god. Uh, no. Okay, I'll be honest, I thought this would be fairly simple to do. <laughs> uh, yeah, this time I went for armor in hopes this would really help, but it, it didn't really change that much, sadly. So, yeah, I'm down to one revival only, instead of having two like before with Ken Lapador. Though I don't really think that necessarily has to do with Ken Lapador, and maybe more with the phrases that I randomly got. So, huh. Yeah, this will be interesting. Like, this time I will still go for Slash because I have armor this time right away and hoping that this will just, like, you know, do the trick. But I have a feeling that this will not work out. I have a very strong feeling that this will not work out at all. Oh, these were the hard ones, right? How are we doing it this time with armor? Eh? Huh? Wendy's is killing me? I guess they still are, but because we have armor, we take way less damage from them, so it doesn't really matter because we just heal it up. Okay, that's good. That's really good, because that means I can literally stand still and just go for the boss here. <laughs> yeah, that's how it works. Like, this is the main benefit of having so many enemies around. They just block off the path to the boss. If they can't kill you, you're good to go. Um, I still need a freeze, though. Did the ender spawn right away? How, how was it? Like, inside of enemies? Because I can just do the same thing that I did for the others right now. I can just literally attack him like this. There's the Arcana. Okay, let's, let's get this. Oh, okay, the other enemy stopped spawning. Uh, well, that's not good. Oh, that's really not good. Yeah, that's really not good. Um, there's the Arcana. That's, that's nice. Okay. I have to run down and I will take a huge amount of damage. Okay, how will I get out of this? I have no idea. The revivals would have been incredibly good right now, actually. Where's the slash? There. Okay, I have to run up. Okay, so the curse is gone. That's good. I need a chicken here. That's not a chicken. Uh, I may actually kill him here. No, uh, but it was. I think it was close. I would say he's down to 30% HP right now. So all I have to do is luck. That's nice. More crits. Actually need that. Kind of. Uh, let's turn around. Let's turn around. Uh, yeah, but this works, right? I can just... Uh, but the curse is about to happen. I have to kill him here. If I don't kill him here, he will kill me. I have to do this. Why well, he stutters a lot, that's good. Okay. Okay. Uh, it's so different. Like, sometimes he can run a lot and sometimes he doesn't. I guess this depends on my crits entirely. So, now we have the bonus enemies here. I have to focus on them somehow, but I used the NFT already, which is bad. Why did I even use that? I should have just waited. Okay, let's turn around. Let's hit that as many as possible. Ender died. Ender died. That's huge. If I can get the Stalker out, because he seems to be the most dangerous one in this bunch. Ouch. Um, I think I will just straight up die here. Unless I get a freeze. That's a chicken. That's not a freeze. Okay. Okay. Okay, let's keep running, let's keep running, let's keep running. We got the stacks, we got the stacks, we got the stacks, we got the stacks, we got the stacks. We just need to stutter them enough. Oh my god. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, okay, let's walk into them that our balls hit them. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I didn't look at, look at the timer. I think we have enough time, right? Oh, die, 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 die. Mm, I should have looked at the timer when I froze them. Okay, that's fine, though. That's fine. Uh, What do I do now? Wing sprays a hollow heart. is a lot of HP. That could actually save me. Okay, let's go for that. It sounds maybe weird. I don't think this deals too much damage to us, so we can literally just walk down, take this. Triple chest, huge. That's a huge amount of bonus HP. It's not... So if you keep getting hit, it doesn't make a difference how... Oh. Oh, okay, I see. Yeah, I see. I see the problem. Yeah, that's understandable. 
My damage feeling is telling me we may kill him here, but he may also kill me. We do not have more revivals, and I lost the only revival that I had, sadly. We killed him. That was such a fast kill! Wait, imagine the entire run long, I would only focus on damage. I may just be strong enough to wipe out like the all the enemies that are a danger for me. I think I'll try this if this run fails. So, um, let's see how we're doing here. I will just face them and try to kill them as fast as possible. If everyone is dead but the Drowner, we are more than fine. Like, the Drowner is totally easy to deal with. Kind of. Mostly. Uh, might. Nice. Can you stop walking towards me? Wasn't there an NFT somewhere? I thought I had an NFT left over. Whoa! Was that a rosary? Did... I... I don't think so, right? We just killed them. No, there was there was a rosary. That must have been a rosary. There's no way this was anything else but a rosary. Wait, they can die to a rosary? I mean, you can on other stages. Ah, uh, my decks, not area. You can do that on other stages, but I didn't know it works here. Interesting. So I all I have to do is just save a rosary for them. Oh, that's good that I, <laughs> that I learned about that. Right? There's no way we just killed them with our main weapon. I'm pretty sure there was a rosary. So, in this run, I also skipped a huge amount just to see if this works. That means usually I think we would have a higher level, um, which is also good to know. Like, if this is close, then I can definitely try it again and also attempt to not die, but it's easier said than done. You know, the early bosses without Silent Old Sanctuary are insane. But I think the next... That's not even close. Okay, new plan. We will go for inverse mode. That means, yes, the enemies, they have three times as much HP as usual, but it also means I can just go for Silent Old Sanctuary. And if I learned anything, as long as you have that, it is fairly simple to deal with the enemies early on. That means I will not die. And there we go. We got Mad Groove. Uh, oh. Yeah, it just soaked in everything, right? And I got a freeze there, that's not good. Because I wanted to have that in the future. Now the question is, what do we actually need? And I think I will just run through all of them, and if I don't want something, I will just put it down again. Oh, wait, I should do that now. Yeah, and I probably also want to, to have bonus HP. Yeah, that sounds good. Okay, this, we do, we'll never have a track orb. Spellbinder, we don't need that, we don't need you. I will take the spinach. The wings, is that worth it to pick up? I don't think so, because later on it will... Like, it reduces the cooldown, which is nice, but I think it's just a waste later on. Um, higher crit chance, sure. Uh, is that everything? I think that's everything, so now it's time to open the chests. I save them. Please give me something good, because I have to deal with the guardians. Hello. <laughs> Why are you moving around? Why are you doing that? Um, no! Did I just pick up my rosary? That was for the reapers. Mmm, no, that's great. And I picked up another freeze. Okay. Nice, we didn't get a single triple chest. That's amazing. That's, uh, oh. Uh, well, I guess I can just do this, right? Do you think this will be enough? How much damage are we dealing? We are dealing a lot of damage, but I'm getting a bit concerned that the moment they unfreeze, they will just kill me because curse is about to happen. I may have to, yeah, I have to pick up the freeze, right? I I'm not convinced if I had it, like, if I had to, but... Um, okay, uh, huh, okay, okay, this could be a little bit harder than I thought it would be. Uh, armor? Oh, we may face another issue, because the items of the guardians are now next to me, I may accidentally get forced into them. Like, and even if I say no, it will still spawn a guardian. Oh, well, that's not great. Would it be better to just spawn all four of them at once, then? Hmm... I mean, so far, it's fine. Clarity is the biggest issue. Oh, I walked into another rosary. Okay, this is slightly annoying. But yeah, clarity is by far the biggest issue. Like, I have no idea what's going on. I don't know where the enemies are. I, I, I have, like, no idea at all. My plan is still to go for as much might as possible to just blow the enemies out of existence. I just walked through everything there. Uh, let's just get this chest because I don't get triple chests either way. Hollow Heart is nice. You want to have this before you start dying, because you revive with more HP then. Okay. Luck is okay, but this is better right now. Just get as much HP as possible. I guess healing is actually decent. Do I heal more from my hits now? I don't think so, right? No, it's a return on an 8, right? That's not a 9. It's a little bit hard to see. Yeah, that's an 8. So the healing is not increased, but the chickens are increased, which is kind of nice. 
Oh my god, <laughs> you don't see that, but the guardians sometimes, they jump around like crazy and I'm just standing there, please don't hit me, please don't hit me, I know your damage guys, please don't hit me. Okay, what happens now? Uh, we are dealing with the normal enemies, that's very good, we're actually not gathering any experience right now, which is perfect. Because then I can choose when I want to pick it up. Oh, wow. Um, okay, now is the moment I want to choose to pick it up. Okay. Clover, more crits is nice. Actually, more HP is better. Uh, whatever, we'll just go for whatever it offers to me. And I think I will just focus on a bit more area right now. Like, it's great if I have the damage to deal with the enemies. But if I don't have the area to actually... Hit, I should face to the left side. What am I doing? Why am I not facing to the left side? Uh, did it change to the left side? Yeah, okay, now it changed. Please don't stop leveling up now, because the moment it stops, I'll start getting hit! Okay. <laughs> that was spicy. Oh, there's more experience. Nice. Great. <sighs> yeah, let's discard that. We don't need more of that. Um, that, that was the topic that I was kind of referring to. Did we kill the other two guardians? Oh, yeah! I guess that means I could have just spawned all four in and then attempt to deal with them right away. That may have been... Is that a freeze? Yeah, that's a freeze. You know what? I will eventually walk into that, so let's just spawn him right now. Uh, okay, this will not even be close to killing them, right? But I want to kill the crab, at least. Um, that freeze was horrible. Like, it would have been great to... I can't go... I can't go anywhere. Is the crab dead? I think the crab is dead. Do not walk on the boss trigger, okay? <laughs> Don't trigger the crab again. Ooh. Red gems, red gems, red gems. Where are you all? Area might, nice. I wish you could just auto select something, you know, that you could lock in a choice and then you just press escape and you can remove that again. But every single level up, it will try to take that. And maybe you could even make a priority system like number one is a mount, number two is might, and number three is area. So in that order, if it appears, it will take it. Did I. Oh man, it soaked in all the experience again. Okay. I just would like to deal with the boss. We have to reduce the amount of enemies we are facing. Yeah, that's a perfect timing to end the freeze. Oh, you dingus. Okay. Uh, there's a chicken. Nice. Do I even want to go for the crit or do I want to go for... Well... I don't really have an... I mean, I could go for Awake. I have so many revivals, I may be able to make that work. Do I want to go for Awake? Huh... Huh. For those of you that have said, hey, you should go for Bloodline Arcana because it's so broken. Well, the issue is you have to kill them with contact damage. And if you don't have a weapon that deals contact damage, like we don't have one, it, it just doesn't have that uh, trait or whatever you call it, characteristic. And then you have to kill them with body contact damage, which deals barely any damage. And the bigger issue is our weapon is literally the definition of protection against weak enemies. You know, it just keeps them away. And that means we would never increase our damage unless we go down in HP. Oh, this was a tough wave, right? No, this was easy with the armor that we have now. Yeah, let's just keep going for... Might? Wait, but if I don't go for crit, do I really want to keep going for might then? I don't think so. Well, but we still have to kill the enemies, right? Yeah. And Might gives us a very short breathing room. Um, honestly, I think I will just go for Wake. That sounds like the best thing to do. Like, getting three revivals would already be insane, but getting plus one armor and 10% HP every single time we die is kind of bonkers. The only question is, will it be enough to survive the enemies? I, I hope so, I guess. That's the only thing I can say. I hope so. Now, usually speaking, okay, depending on what type of video I make, I usually ban the use of Awake because it's kind of broken. Like, if you go for a survival challenge, it's really insane. But, hey, this time I was challenged by someone, this wasn't my idea, so these are not my rules, and we'll just do whatever we can. That is still according to the the idea of the challenge, you know. Uh, my, so similar in the beginning how I said I don't want to not pick up Curse until I have it for Mad Groove. Because then you could do something like, oh no, the arcana chest was on the floor until the very end of the game, or two arcana chests, you know. And then you pick up Wicked Season at minute 1455 and the Mad Groove and quickly get the Skullomaniac. Is that really in the spirit of the challenge? I don't think so, you know, so we are not doing that. Okay, we have the arcana, nice. So we are looking for a way, there it is. Huh, this will be interesting. I wonder if this is enough to beat it. 
Oh, um, okay, there are no more enemies spawning, right? To, the, uh, to block the Guardian. Oh, I will die here when I turn around. Uh, not sure how I made that. Is the Guardian dead? The Guardian just died, but that's how you deal with him. <laughs> we need a Rosary. <laughs> the Mad Groove took all of my Rosaries. Okay. So, yeah, but we still want to go for damage. Amount is, I guess, also fine. Maybe even just for the reason that it can never appear again. There's still another boss in there. Okay, the boss is done, so there's a chest. Uh, there we go. Haven't gotten a single candy box so far. But as I said, I even if I would get it, I don't think I would actually accept it as a viable thing to do. Because, you know, the point was to go for one singular weapon. And yes, even though you get this on the normal stage, I, I think it would just be too much. Like, it wouldn't be in the sense of the challenge. So the Reapers are about to spawn. We have somewhat of a way to deal with them in the beginning. This. Why are you down there? You really didn't need to be down there. Okay, we have to wait a moment, wait a moment, wait a moment. Now. Okay, they're, they're about to get unfrozen. So, the plan is... I think the plan is just find a rosary, honestly. Yeah, I, I would say that just find a rosary. Oh, that's the ender. Oh, that's, that's NFT. That's NFT. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I don't even care that it shoots at me. Like, I will out-heal that easily because of the high armor we have. Yep, there we go. Nice. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Wow. Okay, so there's only... Wait. Oh, that wasn't the end of the diet. Did I actually pick up a rosary? That could have been that they were dead the entire time. Oh, that would be funny. Because the, the drowner was outside of the screen and the ender doesn't die to rosary either way. Yeah, that could be... Okay. So now it's very important to take on these two bosses. I need to do that ASAP. Please. Uh, Might is nice. There is a freeze that we could use. I mean, I can just go for a pool party, you know. Oh, yeah, right. That happens. Oh. Huh. Okay, we are not killing any enemies at all. I mean... <laughs> okay, funny. <laughs> funny. I could just go for Laurel and this would be utterly insane, but we are skipping. I'll stick to my word. Now, in case nothing works and I realize... Oh. Um. Okay, so the problem is... I don't know where the freeze is. I don't know where anything is. <laughs> because I don't see anything. <laughs> uh. Down there? Uh, might, I guess? The thing is, I'm not even killing enemy. It, it doesn't even benefit me to do that. I'll do random always. Like, it makes no difference at this point because I'm not killing enemies either way. And if you say, don't take a bath, it, it makes not really, like, a big difference. Like, look at this. Yeah. Um. Okay, someone died. It's the ender? Oh, okay, the bubble bath is gone. Maybe now I can find the actual items? But I'm dying so much. I have only three revivals left. I guess I will just walk around and attempt to always... There's the... Finally! Dude, they shit around so much. Okay, what do we do now? What is the plan? Do we just try to endure this as long as possible? Uh, there's a vacuum that doesn't have to they shit around like crazy. Is there any benefit in, like... Not moving? Oh! Wait, what bats? Was that it? Well, that was the first part at least. A minute 14 will also be very difficult. But we may have managed to survive it. Now we just have to clean up the golems. Yeah, that was a rosary. Okay, beautiful. Well, okay, a few are left. Um, wait, but that means I all I have to do now is I have to gather as many freezes as possible. At least one. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. That's just amazing. Can we still time skip, by the way? No, you can't do that anymore. Interesting, because that would have been really good to win here. So the plan right now is we have three revivals. That means we survive for quite a long time. We have one freeze. The mo hmm. We had two freezes. <laughs> now we only have one freeze. The moment we had 14 minutes, it will accumulate all the items. And it's very likely that... Oh, there's another freeze. Okay, don't move, Dex. I don't want to pick up two freezes now. Please just let me pick up one. Okay, when I said please just let me pick up one, I actually thought you... Okay, we got one. That's flying in. Um, oh, that's a... Did you see how fast they killed me, though? That was insane. That was absolutely mental. We have another freeze here on the curse. That's good. Okay, let's go. Nice, nice. Jesus Christ, that damage is insane. Dude, I have so much armor. Like, you need to understand. I have... Oh. 
You die by rosaries, right? Okay, good, good, good. Another freeze. Let's go. Why is that chest? Jesus, why is it so laggy? <laughs> Did you see that lag? Okay. Not sure if there's a freeze here. Oh my god, that's a lot of enemies. There's a freeze, right? No, that's a vacuum. Okay, wait, I, but I have gotten a freeze somewhere. They were frozen for so long. Uh, I only have two revivals. Stay away from me, 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 NFT! I will fire up your butts. Let's go! Oh, it lags a little bit, just a little bit. <laughs> well, there you go. We did it. We beat the challenge. You got my PayPal address? I'm just kidding. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, then don't forget to subscribe and give the video a like. See you the next time.